And so when the Oof. doctor came on Saturday morning, she tried flushing it twice and it still didn't work. So I had to have the wonderful experience of having that catheter removed and another one put in without any anesthetic. Mm. Yeah, that it's was killing me. Just here. I remember you, you oh. mentioned that. I was like, oh, that sounds so terrible. It was horrible because everything down there is really raw too it's because mm -hmm. they just modified raw and swollen and, yeah. yeah so that wasn't fun but um she yikes yeah you really went through it i yeah. hope it's going better now but then i could be um and then uh so i had the surgery on the 28th and the following monday a doctor came and took the second catheter out and took the packing out of my out of my vaginal canal and i was allowed to shower <gasps> that's and, the best oh girl it was like the best shower ever so um yeah and since then it's just um they after that they teach you how to dilate um there's after you shower uh yeah after you shower um mm -hmm. well it was the next day that i got taught yeah that. sometime very soon after they remove the packing yeah. you gotta start dilating right exactly so you dilate three times a day for the first three months and then for three to six months is twice a day six to twelve months is once a day and after that either a few times a week or just get laid with something that penetrates you yeah. a few times a week. So, but <laughs> yeah. Fuck. What they, is the problem today? They, they actually told me to start the second size up of dilator now, which it feels kind of soon. I tried it last night and it one, it was intimidating because it's quite a bit bigger than, um, than the smallest one. But then when I removed it, it looks like there's a little bit of a prolapse or something. So I took a picture and sent it to my doctor. And yeah, um, mm. that that's my vagina experience. Now I just, you know, dilate three times a day and wear pads and make all sorts of gross things on the pads. So yeah, I, it is a full time job. It is for a while. It is. And it's a lot. It's a lot. So kudos to you for getting what you needed done for you and kudos for you for continuing to deal with it day after day 